happy day students this is your last chapter in this particular chapter this textbook just class chapter 9 surfing internet yes class 6 so we are going to see what is internet how to work with internet by this time most of you might be knowing but still we'll have a overview internet means now i am you are connected network by some networks right and that international network is known as internet i may be in my native you may be in my native or we are located in different places but we are able to connect to each other so network of networks we call it as a internet then they are telling some of the history of internet how it came into be who started with what was the first name of it uh, and what came to the birth of internet so those history they have gone through it over here then popular service the first will be the world wide web you might be searching for something you might be having some website so it's world wide web ww is a world wide web wherein every letter any internet explorer or anything will start with the world wide www dot if it's a school sign academy dot like that every email url starts with the w e-commerce flip card where they want to take the to, uh, book your tickets you have go pay we go and many other applications all those are e-commerce you're doing some electronic using help of electronic commerce you're doing some transaction you may be buying vegetables or you may be buying some fruits or anything you can buy some your shoes socks dresses everything is possible nowadays with e-commerce like some example some indra flipkart or alex right then chatting chatting whatsapp is there for you skype you can chat then even when we are having connected with gmt you are able to chat with me yes so those chatting is possible and video conference and nothing other than what we are having we are able to see face to face we are i am sharing my screen you are able to tell me something through your audio. I am able to share my video. So all these comes under video conferencing. Social networking sites. Most of you would have been there. Facebook, Insta, all these are known as social networking connects. Uh, Link lead professional social website. Okay. So there are many of Facebook or could link lead. All these are social networking websites. Then e-banking. You might have seen your parents uh, doing online transaction. Yes. They may give your username, password, and they may write the amount, required amount, and do the transaction. Your school payment fee may happen like this, or your booking your tickets, anything may happen through e-banking. You may find the bank statement, find what is the balance, everything at your home using your phone or system. So next, what is the next use of internet? Searching information. If I'm asking you to come with some information, you will be just taking Chrome and searching a topic over here image related or the results or whatever comes in news regarding that particular topic all will be appearing then email email means if you want to share something you want to share a file or attachment officially or to your friends you will use an email so over here the basically we are going to see how to compose and send a mail so before composing and sending a mail you will have to the i am using help of gmail to show you what it is so continue to gmail if you want, you can either go for create account. You will, they will be asking you for whom. It will be for if yourself. This is how where you can create a Google account. Your first name, last name, your username, password. You have to give one password and you have to confirm that password. Then if this use this particular first uh, with this particular username ID, this password will be mapped. Okay. So if you already have, then you go for sign in. Give your you use a username over here and after giving the username it will ask you for the password so i'm just giving you a example hope this mail id i don't i'm not much sure it's just, it's exist or not uh, let okay may appear or may not come in yeah because i told you it may not happen so want any school official mail id whichever you know you can or any mail id if you want whichever mail id we have already created right that mail id you can give it over here and click next it will ask you for the password okay. now i have logged into my mail id if i click on compose over here you can see compose if i click on that it will ask me to which particular mail id i want to send what's the subject line and what is the content over here so i'll be just giving the whatever the two addresses if you are sending to you Whatever your mail ID is that I will be printing subject regarding what I have to share it with you and the content I will be sharing. So composing and sending mail. You will be clicking on compose and mail appears like this. Then you, how to attach a file. Attach a file means if you have some files to be attached. 
you can see clip over here right if you click on this attach file it will ask you whether you want to browse some details how we want to suppose if my am just giving you a detail of any one of the file i'm going to select and sharing it to you i'll click on open that file will be attached yes then replying or forwarding emails same like this when you get a for mail open you have a option for replying or forwarding it reply means to that particular person you are replying forwarding means whatever that person has sent to you as such i can forward it with the attach along with the attachments adding a signature to the mail if you might have noticed when i open my mail i have it shows regards to something right that is known as signature so how you can add that signature to a mail id it is showing so on how to add a signature to a mail over here you have a okay here you have a settings button if you click on that setting button it will ask you see you will have to click on all settings when you click on all settings this particular settings will appear in that general in the general you just scroll down you will be able to see asking you to add the signature so i have given my signature and with regards name has been typed it so that is how you add a signature to your email the last topic is log out of sign out that is if you click on this particular option you will show your mail id and you have our sign out option option you just click it over there yeah that's how you send the mail so with this this chapter gets over so and all the chapters of your classics also has come to a net okay thank you students have a nice day